Hey, what's up guys? Today, I have uh, Eskimo Stingray S33 uh, Auger here. Uh, still in the box, just picked it up yesterday. And um, I was looking online, didn't see anything for as far as like reviews goes. So I decided I figured I'd do an unboxing and a uh, full review. So um, this is what you're gonna get when you pick it up. Um, one of the main reasons why I decided to get it was uh, the price point. It was uh, on sale at Gannermount for $279. And uh, the closest one to it was uh, a Strike King and they had a few other um, Jiffies and things like that. But I uh, decided to get this just mainly because of the price point at $279. It's tough to beat. So uh, what you'll get on here, it comes with uh, the Viper engines. Uh, some of the specs that it's going to read on here is uh, the en engine RPM is at 9,000, the displacement is at 33cc, uh, gear ratio is 49.1 or 49 to 1. Uh, the auger diameter is actually this is an 8 inch, and weight is uh, 28 pounds, and it also comes with a two year uh, limited warranty. So uh, the package is pretty nice and sturdy, as you can tell. And, uh, Gonna go ahead and unbox this. I'm gonna go ahead and rip it open and see what it comes to. Pretty easy to open. Nice cardboard cover to it all. Shipping it is good. So right off the bat, I took the cardboard out, and I'm not sure if you can see, but it actually comes with the instruction manual, obviously, a nice uh, decal, uh, tool, all that fun stuff. Um, one thing I noticed right off the bat is it does come with uh, a cover for the blades, so you don't have to actually purchase that take the engine off itself, so the engine itself, the, the handles are covered with plastic, which is always nice. Everything seems to be assembled, the on and off button, the choke, the, the spark plug and the wires, everything's all assembled. So I'll set that down, nice brand new engine. have the uh, auger, uh, 8 inch uh, auger itself. So what I'm talking about is actually this cover here. A lot of times you actually have to buy this and uh, this one comes with it so it's pretty nice. It basically covers the blades so it doesn't um, get dull as fast. One thing, I, one thing you'll have to do is uh, take the Allen wrench out of here. There's actually a Allen wrench nut up here that you'll have to unscrew so you can screw it to that uh, motor. So I'm gonna go ahead and take this out. You can see it, but the nut's right there. So with this, you should be able to pull it out. So. I'm going to take this off and assemble the auger here. So one thing, one thing I noticed right off the bat, um, it does slide right in perfectly. Uh, you'll have to bring it up just slightly so it adjusts the holes so it'd be in line. There is uh, some oil on it already, which is great. So it's actually moved. Um, so one thing you'll notice right off the bat is one end on top here is bigger. So you slide the actual um, you know, uh, bolt into it in that direction. And the other end is uh, smaller, so it screws it to so it locks. So I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, put this thing in. And just like that, you have this simple. So, pretty easy. Um, now all I gotta do is uh, put 
put some gas in it and uh, run it. So um, that's the plan. Pretty lightweight for the most part and it comes with the Viper engine. So stay tuned for the next one. I'll uh, fire this thing up for the first time and show you guys how it's like. So that's my uh, Eskimo Stingray S33 uh, unboxing for it and assembly. Thanks for watching guys.